Hey guys and welcome back, Oscar Moon with some more Hogwarts uh, Legacy. We're gonna... Well, we're gonna go back and speak to him in the Antcroft. Let's just see if we can manage some more. What? Oh. Boom, ba -doo, ba -doo, boom, boom, boom. That, I mean, that song is so soothing to me. I don't know why. Uh, now what am I supposed to do? Pardon me, is everything all right? No, no, it's not. We only had two bells to go, but she just had to go and spoil things. I'm afraid what? I don't follow. Who spoiled things? Was it what bells? <sighs> Professor Black ordered Mr. Moon to take down the bells in the bell tower. Said they were giving him a headache. Those bells are a part of Hogwarts. Oh yeah, I'm Wasn't so confused that, that someone so, else's name else in this game is Mr. Moon. Put them back. We've always been a duo of sorts. Adelaide and Evangeline. Addie and Evie. Anyway... It was going swimmingly until Black started asking questions. I had not accounted then for that before. Then she wasn't comfortable with our rule breaking. Now I'm before stuck. starting the game, that Unable is. Unable to tell which bell goes where. Perhaps I could help put the bells back up. Really? Oh, that would be wonderful. The bells are in the bell tower just above the music room. You're certainly of more help than Adelaide. I imagine the bells are just inside in the bell tower. <clears throat> yeah, we can do that later. First, we're gonna... No? Alright, we're gonna do it now. There's the fountain. I'm getting closer. What? Closer to what? Uh. Okay. Um. This stairwell looks promising. This looks like the portrait from the map. And where's the treasure? Revelio. Hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. There was a doorway hidden within the portrait. Whoa, okay. I wonder what came of Arthur's search. All right. Um, hmm. Hello, Hamora. Okay, 10-7, I don't understand this. Uh, hmm. Chest. 
Well, that sucks. Do you suppose Black's children are as condescending and ill-tempered as he is? What are you doing? That doesn't sound... Oh, hey. Excellent. Hmm. Rebellion. Oh, sorry. Lumos. No. Okay, um... What uh... the bells must be upstairs. Oh. Hello, Homora. Now, yeah, come on. Okay, so spec spectacles. Uh, can lose that. Three sixty. Okay, cool. All right, where are you at? Oh, there you are. Akio, Wingardium Leviosa. Akio. 
Where are you supposed to go? Well, that wasn't too hard. Evangeline right. should be pleased about this. Even if Black isn't. Alright, I'm not pleased about this. So through here. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Revelio. Yeah. The bells are back up, Evangeline. Ah, oh, you're a credit to the school. I can't wait to hear them. I can't wait for the headmaster to hear them. I wish I could see his face. Future right. generations Me may too. not truly appreciate what you've done, but I do. And I hope that you do as well. <clears throat> I don't know how much this means for me and for Hogwarts. All's well that ends well. All right. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Yeah, but, uh... Okay. Alohomora. There is something. What? I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Yeah, but... Twenty one. I don't understand. Rebellion. Okay. Accio. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Accio. Confringo. Bombarda. Arrest 
Expelliarmus, Akion. Lumos. Devolso. Lumos. Reparo. God damn it. Confringo, Bombarda. Confringo. Bombarda. Confringo. Glaciers. Incendium. Levioso. Expelliant. Accio. How do I? Mm. There was something else too. A dash of powdered bat spleen. Revelio. Okay, Revelio. That's it. Um. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Project. <clears throat> hey, man. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. Um, yeah. That's <laughs> nice to hear. I have had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is, in fact, warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, and, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a... a... puff scheme. Ugh, well, they seem innocent, but their tongues can be most disturbing. Exactly. I wish more of our fellow students agreed with you. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even taken to calling me Puff Skeen Dunkeen. I'm sorry to hear <laughs> that. That's actually funny, yeah. Can be cool. Thank you. Right. <clears throat> Poppy keeps offering to help me in overcoming my fear, but I'm too afraid to take her up on it. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Yes, you shall. <clears throat> Venomous Valor. Find and enter the hidden herbology hmm. corridor. Hidden herbology corridor. Sounds intriguing. Well... I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Well, I found one. Revelio. Where's the other one then? Is it in the tree? No? No? Uncle Roland sends his best. He often asks after you and his owls. Revelio. My friends and I lose track of the What? When I'm in hospital, should never have trusted them.
Rebellion. Yeah, right, not one of those. I have a potion I Oh, we're going the same direction. <laughs> okay. <coughs> well, this time I'm not gonna go bananas. Rebellion. Hello. Rebellion. All right, we're getting uh, we're getting things done. Likely, this astronomy table will be best used when it's dark. Right. These dry vines are one spark away from becoming kindling. Incendio. Okay. That wasn't too hidden. This must be the entrance to the hidden herbology corridor. Yep. Devil's snare seems to thrive in darkness. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. Lumos. Ah. All right, so I've been doing fire this whole time. I mean, that didn't... Useless scarf. Um, Lumos. Hmm. Good for you. Seems the devil's snow was protecting a chest of some kind. Hmm. Damn it, my slots. Hmm. 
Lumos. Okay. I imagine a piece of that enormous venomous tentacular would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. All right. You're probably right. of my own sharing a dormitory all year has been samantha is everything all right no no it's not he's he's been cursed he he simply never listened i'm sorry how exactly has he oh you won't believe it truly but his feet were turned into purple <laughs> okay i won't even go into the attention he was getting um yeah i'm so sorry i'm glad you want well it is it's entirely his own fault. I, my brother's all, and to prove his point. How awful. Exactly. And no I'm gonna help him, but I'm just gonna quickly go through all this. Possibly. The curse stems from a crest that was stolen from Marmaduke. If the, you okay. battle troll, returning a crest. Yes. I can take the crest. Oh, thank you. You'll simply go into the, according to my reason. You'll find it just easy. All right, but Thank first, you for your help. my family is indebted to you. I need to find the tomb near Brockborough and place Samantha's family crest on a sarcophagus there. Uh, yeah, but first I'm gonna find the. Where are the Duncan? Move it. I'm going back to Duncan. Have you found anything to uh, prove my bravery yet? Yes. Hello, Duncan. I have the... That's one leaf. Must have been a giant venomous tentacular. It's even more than I expected. I appreciate you getting it for me. Of course. I hope this helps you. This is sure to put an end to Puff's scheme dunking for good when I show everyone in the common... This will show ever how ridiculous that nickname is. Thank you again. <clears throat> Thank you for all of your help. No more puff scheme dunking for me. Deposit. Oh, it's another one of those. <clears throat> hmm. uh, maybe later. Let's do. Let's see. No, exactly. Let's. Uh... Secret rooms. A rumor requirement. And uh, because we have some stuff that we haven't really unlocked yet, so let's do that. Dark sun hat, fair green sorcerer hat, emblem scarf. Okay.
Okay, so defense is down, but offense is up by four. So that's... Hmm. 18. Fifty one. Ah, Go on, uh, say one more quest. There's a lot of speaking with Sebastian. But we really want to learn Vada Kadabra. And I know for a fact that we learned that from him. <clears throat> I don't think of another. Uh, I don't know of another uh, way to do it, but I'm afraid that we have done something in the past that will not, you know, make him give us it. So we'll see. My uncle. I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feltcroft, nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. Of course you he did. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. If he thinks <clears> banishing <throat> me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form, and that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne. To reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. Yeah, sure. I want uh, I'll send you an a lot of Kadabra. <clears throat> all right. Revelio. Ah. Uh. Come on. A 
And you say they made it after you placed the moonstone. Do you know why or what it means? Does it have to do with Protagoras. the Protagoras? Hey. The breadth of one's knowledge can be as wide as the seas, and yet only run so deep. It's good to see you again, Doran. Did Poppy tell you about everything that's happened? She did, and I am glad to see that you are both safely returned. I did question the wisdom of sending you on a path at a time when that path was unknown at best. Deadly at worst. But the acumen of the centaurs is neither personal nor partial. The skies tell us what is to come, and often we do not know what we have seen until it has come to pass. You okay. knew the poachers would try and kill Poppy and me. I did not know, my young friend. But I shall say that I was not surprised. It was in much the same manner that I expected our first meeting. I don't suppose you'd like to start from the beginning. I think Poppy and I could use that. Of course. I find it is often the best place to start, is it not? Many, many moons ago, I divined a series of events. Their meaning long evaded me, until you brought news of the Snidgets and their poacher pursuers. I believe the symbol created by the Mooncalves dance marks the place the Snidgets are hidden, and serendipitously, I believe that I know the very place. Please, go on. I have seen that symbol only once, on a rock face in the cliffs of the forest. You should make haste there. The Snidgets that have been kept there for so many years may no longer be safe. If you're right about this place, then we should make our way there. I shall see you there. Okay, can't we go there together? Can't afford to lose the Snidgets once again. Uh, okay. Come on. Okay. Glaciers. Wow, okay. <clears throat> that was pretty far away. Time to help with an urgent delivery. Revelio. Hmm. Okay. be terribly grateful if you could help me and my friend with a time delivery. Yeah, well, don't have time, dude. here as soon as I could. Did, of course Doran implied as much. Could this actually be where the Snidgets are hit? Let's find out. I'm ready if you are. Alright, let's go. Can you believe it? Actual Snidgets. Yes. I'm glad we seem to be a step ahead of the poachers. It is a little strange we haven't heard anything from them. If we're Rebellion. lucky, they're still poring over Gran's research. There was a fair amount. We, on the other hand, had Doran to guide us. 
Even if the poachers do somehow stumble upon this place, we shall be long gone. Okay. Where you at? Okay, so I get thirty XP from that. <clears throat> hey man. Greetings. Yeah, well, greetings I indeed. Kept you waiting long, Doran. Not at all. Then again, it is not I who awaits your arrival. Protego. Do you have the Moonstone with you? Yes. We do. Good. It's as as important to what happens next as both of you are. So, what does happen next? What are these pillars here? A safeguard, I suspect. There is only one way to find out. And as for how to go about that, the two of you may know better than anyone. What are you talking about? Figure out how to enter the ruins. Alright. Alright. So, sun and... Uh, that one. I wonder if the thing is me. There you go. Sun and uh, And that one, which is this one, okay. Akio. All right, um, <clears throat> hmm. okay, so I can't. Oh, wait, it's the one with the uh, that's the wrong one, it's this one. All right. Okay. Hmm. 
And that's the star. Moon. That one, that one. That one, that one. That one. Okay. Uh. Perhaps it has Rebellion. to be in the darkness. What do you mean? Incendium. It's that. Oh, okay. So this one. This one should be here. I thought they were the same, but they're not. And then this one. That's darkness and the sun. Perhaps it has to do with the light in the darkness. Yes. Accio. Obviously. Okay. What? Uh, I don't know. That one. Oh, wait. So you are on the first ring and you are on the second ring. So maybe you should stand. Uh, Perhaps it has to do with the light in the darkness. There you go. Maybe you should just be on the same page, you know. Okay, so you are glowing. Okay, so if I put... Do you stop glowing? No? Okay. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and... Uh... Perhaps it has to do with the light in the darkness. Okay, so now you are glowing. So I need to get you glowing. And... You glowing. Right? Now nothing is glowing, okay?
Now you are glowing. It has to do with the light of yes. The Right now you are glowing. And then we need to get you glowing. That did it. Look, Doran, a doorway. Oh, okay. I suspect we all know what lies beyond that passage. And now, I'm Revelio. At least for a time. You're not coming in with us. Well, screw you, dude. <clears throat> I'm going in. Revelio. Hmm. Look at the moon. It's a new must have been built to protect them. They had no What makes you say that? The poacher camp's Rebellion. was depressing. It's hard to explain, but the feeling was palpable. At least to me. The sense I get here is of safety and calm. Quite the opposite of the poacher camps. Kundringo! Bombarda! Arrest those women! Hmm. Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! <coughs> <coughs> One. Whoever built this place certainly liked to read. And the books are all about creatures. Okay. Your gran would love it here. She would. I can't wait to tell her all about it. Search for the snidgets. Right. Revelio. Incendio. I'll wager this isn't the dead end it seems to be. But how to get through? <clears throat> well, Accio, Guardian Leviosa. Leviosa, Accio, Guardian Leviosa. There you go. Oh man. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Accio. Oh, sorry, man. Watch it. Okay. Rebellio. Hmm. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Leviosa. Expelliant. Leviosa. 
Alright, so should I switch? Should I switch them? Watch out, dude! No? I don't get it. Alright, uh, I'm gonna get back to you in the next episode and see what's up. Um, so, yeah, thanks for now. See you later. I'm out.